You know, I think, I think Notre Dame is a place that has always fought for social justice. I know in my office I got a picture of Father Hesburgh with Martin Luther King arm in arm in the fight for civil rights. And I was, I was really proud of our team, um, and especially Taya, stepping up and being willing to publicly stand for something you really believe in. Um, I think one of the things I try to teach them is that you got to fight. You got to fight for what you want. And you got to fight for playing time. You got to fight to win a national championship. You have to be willing to stand up and fight. And you have to be accountable in that fight. And, and the accountability doesn't end when they leave the locker room. You know, it's, it's not just about basketball. Basketball is just a game. And the thing that it teaches you is about life. And these are the lessons that I want them to learn. I want to have strong, confident women who are not afraid to use their voice and take a stand. I don't ever want them to be victims. And so I'm really proud of what we did today. Um, and I think it's hopefully something that will catch fire and that people across the country will start to think about and ask themselves to look in the mirror and say, what are you willing to fight for? You know, I, I think there's a there's an old saying, if you're not part of the solution, you're part of the problem. And I think it's time people looked in the mirror and said, you know what, maybe there's the problem. What are you willing to stand up and fight for? So I, I couldn't be prouder of what they did today.